Indian refiners will continue to purchase Iran's crude oil despite the U.S. sanctions on Tehran's oil exports, which are due to be imposed in November. The United States will renew sanctions on Iran after withdrawing from a nuclear deal forged in 2015 between Tehran and World Powers. India, Iran's number two oil client, is now working to win a waiver from the restrictions to protect its wider exposure to the U.S. financial system. With the decision on insurance, India is making a case that it wants, it really wants to continue with the, uh, with the oil arrangement. And I think if you look at the oil scenario around the world, in India prices are rising, I think India can ill afford uh, to cut its trade. And that's a sentiment that I think India has expressed repeatedly. According to available data, India has lifted about 658,000 barrels of oil per day from Iran in April to August. But India's oil ministry says New Delhi will cut its monthly crude loadings from Iran from September and October by nearly half. We have conveyed to the United States our compulsions about energy. And by the way, India is not alone. On hydrocarbon imports, Japan is much the same boat, South Korea, Indonesia. There are a number of countries, major economies of Asia, that are importing oil from Iran. So I think a considered and calibrated decision would have to be taken about this, both by the U.S., and its partners like India. Earlier, the Indian government had given permission to state-owned refiners to import oil from Iran with Iranian tankers after the biggest Indian shipping company backed out. India is Iran's second largest single oil customer and is expected to cut down purchases of Iranian oil. But it is unlikely to cut off completely as Iranian oil is best suited for its refineries. Sanjay Sethi, Press TV, New Delhi.